Hello, everybody. Welcome back once again to this weekend in five walkthrough. All right, so we just finished up the uh, the hatred fortress battle here, and this is again the, the kind of victory plus rewards. Uh, so, anyways, let's get uh, let's get going. Uh, phew, that was rough. Coach got really mad. I didn't know what he was gonna do. Couldn't we have just gone ahead and attacked the fortress? If we'd done that, we would have ended up sacrificing too many of our own, not to mention theirs. We simply needed to clear out the ships defending the fortress. Anything else would have been excessive. Prince will start driving the soldiers out of Hatred Fortress now. Could you go back to the ruins at Karis, uh, Lake for me again? Uh, I'll give a signal that you're sure to see from Saris, or Karis Lake, and when you see that sec signal, open the sluice gate. <clears throat> and could you go with them, Zweig? Hmm. Of course. They wouldn't know how to work the ruins without me. I want to go, too. Me, too. Me, too. All right, Your Highness, good luck on your end. All right, so let's see here. Yeah, we need to, need to throw some characters in here. Actually, let's uh, let's chat here with some people. Oops. I like that uh, they always throw, like, Leon with you for the, the entire game just to help you out with kind of where to go next. Uh, Lord Lake will be all right now, right? Sorry, but Log and Lun will have to stay behind this time. <coughs> they have an important job to do. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. Wow. Kusha asked me for a boat and some oil. I wonder what she's up to. Hmm. Yeah, interesting. Good luck, Prince. That's why we'll know what needs to be done in Karis Lake Ruins. Ah, okay. Uh, so let's stop in here. Um, throw Kyle in. Put Egbert in here for the potch finder. Hear me, filthy devils. <laughs> uh, trade in, trade in. Escape route. I don't really think I need that. Um, I'm going to leave a spot. Well, I'm going to be swapping Maroon into the entourage because I don't want to battle with him. So why Leon Frey? I really need one more character uh, for the battle group. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Shikure. I guess we'll... I'm tempted to take Silides, but... Honestly, Silides is just kind of dead weight at this point. Um, although Vicky would probably be as well. I think I'm going to just take her, though, just to, to kind of level her up if... Well... I don't know how much uh, battling we'll actually do, but... Uh, all right, so let's swap uh, Maroon and Vicky. And then we'll check our formation here. Yeah, we need to put Kyle up front. Um, Zagai probably is still best in the center. And then Zweig, I suppose, is probably fine where he's at. Okay, uh, let's let's go sharpen Zweig. <clears throat> Excuse me. Sharpen Zweig's weapon. Also, let's uh, let's see here. So we got the Thunderhound there. Uh, it looks like this is another uh, heavy uh, armor, right? So uh, unfortunately, not like literally nobody in my party right now can equip this thing. Uh, but physical defense plus thirty eight and lightning defense plus one. That's uh, that's pretty nice. Um, technique ring. I'm gonna give to. Uh, the guy here because he's been missing a lot. I probably can just get rid of this speed ring because he's so slow that that's not really probably doing him that much good. And then let's actually throw some stuff in here. So let's throw the flame armor in. Nobody can use that because again I think that's heavy armor. I suppose right now you know the thunder helm and the the flame armor together would give. You know, somebody protect, or, you know, one additional defense versus, you know, thunder and flame. So I guess that's you know, kind of interesting. A lot of bone stuff here, boots, speed ring. Yeah, this is probably fine. All right, let's, uh, actually, let's see here. Let's put that speed ring on somebody at least. There we go. 
Good old Kyle. Kyle gets it because he's got empty slots. All right. <clears throat> so, I assume the, if I'm remembering correctly, the blacksmith guy is over here somewhere. There's, there's the rune guy. Yeah, here's the blacksmith. Perfect. Yeah, and there we go. We can uh, sharpen them all the way up to seven, so definitely going to do that. I guess probably Vicky can be upgraded as well, although I don't I don't know how much good that's really going to do me, but um, <laughs> Vicky, uh, you know, typically uh, casters are not, you know, so strong, and so <laughs> I don't know that it really is going to do that much good to... Uh, to boost up her weapon, but hey, why not? And I think I'm going to leave Maroons at 1, because I don't plan on using him ever. Uh, we'll stop in here with the equipment shop. I'm going to take a save state. Okay, yeah, nothing. All right, well, that's a shame. All right, let's, uh, let's sell some stuff here. Forehead, God, that's garbage, garbage, garbage. Get rid of all this bone stuff. Really picked up a lot of junk in the ruins um this thing this um boost so we'll get rid of the silence and poison i should have thrown the rage piece in the in the whatchamacallit drain steel um i'm gonna i'm gonna actually just sell these two uh steel pieces i'll actually make this one and I'll probably end up selling that as well, <clears throat> but you know you get a lot more a uh, lot more cash if you actually make the rune and then sell it. But those extra two pieces, I just don't really care. Let's uh, all right. So let's assemble let's assemble that a drain steel violence and boost. Okay, uh, one more. Stop back here. <clears throat> there we are. And sell. Uh, status after receiving damage twice. I may um, probably just hang on to that. I should really actually try this out because I just don't remember. I think the problem with the violence orb is that, you know, 99% of the battles are going to be random encounters in this game. And, um, you know, most random encounters, your characters aren't taking damage twice. So I, I really don't feel like that's, uh, that's that great. Um, where are we trying to go here? Oh, yeah, the, the ruins. How do I even get back there? Can I go back this way? Hopefully I wasn't supposed to... Hopefully I wasn't supposed to go to, like, talk to Log and Lun or something. No, I think we're, I think we're okay. Wait. No, this doesn't seem right. <laughs> I don't think this is right. I think I do need to go up and talk to those two. Yeah, we need to go to, like, Yashuna Village first, probably. Yeah, shoot. Oh, well. Well, it's all right. I take a little detour. I I I meant to do that, but yep, I yep, I, there were no mistakes made there. <laughs> Oops, wrong way. There we are. There we are. Yeah. Okay, so. Uh, Shuna Village, Eastern War, Revolving Bridge. Yeah. Okay. Good deal. Oh, we're we're doing it. We're getting there. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, Jesus. All right. Here we go. Uh, nothing to sell. 
How dare you? There we go. Flame gauntlets junk. Oops. Oh yeah, that's right. This is uh heavy armor. Well, I'm gonna throw this on the guy. Okay. Let's see. Does this place have the uh nope. Um I'm I need to uh I need to remember to, um, I'm actually going to, so I'm going to buy an escape scroll because I know there's going to be, uh, there's going to be a time where I will, you know, find those useful coming up. Let me see something here. Okay. Uh, and I don't want to, you know, I want to actually have some, <laughs> I want to have some on me instead of uh, running around without them. Um, I know one of the, I don't, I don't know if it was the last video or the one before that, it would have, it would have been, you know, somewhat recent but uh went all the way to the end of ugh, now i can't remember the name of that place but um some area where you have to you know run across a bunch of of rocks and you know there's all kinds of crazy different paths and stuff and um it's basically a one way you know and so once you get to the end of it well you really just need to turn around and go back the way you came and uh, it's just a lot faster if you've got an escape talisman that you can use um I think we need to... Crap, do we need to go through the mountain pass again? Or is this right? No. Yeah, yeah, here, here we go. Oh, thank goodness. I'm glad that I didn't go all the way through that and then realize that, oh no, you actually don't need to go there. It's right here. Wow, you can see everything from here. There's Raffleet over there, and that's Hatred Fortress. I hope the signal comes soon. Oh, do we not actually even have to go in there? Okay, well. All right, uh, water. Somebody bring some water, quick. Well, you got water all over you, everybody. Uh, the fire's too strong. We can't get near it. Wow. Okay. All right. The fire's been lifting, I guess. Uh, hey, take a look at that. Yeah, take a look at it. Run. Yeah, do that. Let's get away damn it man and you call yourself soldiers of the kingdom's army back to your posts shut up i'm not dying here out of my way yeah get out of his way dude you heard the man he's got places to be fires to run from all right yeah that was a 
apparently I do as I say, not as I do, because that went, dude went and took off right after them, too. So, All right, anyways, Lucretia, an ingenious plan as usual. The enemy soldiers are all making a mad dash to escape. Phew, it worked. Did it? Uh, I don't know what we would have done if the first ship didn't scare them. None of the other ships had oil in them. They didn't? We didn't want to pollute the river too much, so we used fish oil, but could... But we could only get enough for one ship. <clears throat> Most of those soldiers were newcomers, so I imagine one ship was more than enough to make them lose their heads. And Log made it, made it crash in the most spectacular fashion, or fashion he could, too. He really cut it close there, though. I'll have to give him a talking to later. <laughs> he did come through in the end, you know. He may be an oaf, but he's an oaf with guts. Now let's get back up river. If we waste too much time, we'll be washed away along with Hatred Fortress. My lady, how are you planning to signal his highness? I've got a maneuver that will send the message quite clearly. Ooh, a maneuver, eh? I love maneuvers. Wow, that was awesome. The ship went like wham and the fire was like whoosh. Man, I wish we could have seen it up close. Huh? Raft fleet's pulling back. Uh, then it's time for us to go as well. Huh? But what about the signal? Raft fleet is moving out of the way so they won't get caught in the tsunami when the sluice gate is opened. Oh, I get it. That's the signal. I feel like that would have been hammered out beforehand, but yeah, they've done a good job of, you know, kind of determining what uh, Lucretia's uh, intent was. <laughs> but okay. All right, Prince, let's go. Let's do that. Let's let's go. Let's get at all. Uh, let's speed this back up. Actually, Lorelai. What? You're still here? Hmm. Nice to see you again, too. So did you find what you were looking for? No, I could barely even look around. Without your rune, Prince, you can't get anywhere in these runes. So we're just waiting here, planning to shamelessly invite yourself along with us when we returned? Uh, so what if that was my plan? It's not like you were worried about me, right? Um, I think we want to go with we were worried about you. Let me just see here. Um, yep. Wow. No, we want to go with we don't mind. That's very weird. That's very, yeah, that's very weird that that is what you get a point for instead of we were worried about you. All right, let's just go with we don't mind. Thanks. All right, uh, Lorelai has rejoined. Um, I think I'm going to kick out Cyro. Kyle is a guy. Yeah, all right, well. You know what? I think this is fine. I'm going to leave it like this. Uh, I'm tempted to, to put Lorelei in the main party, but I, I don't think that that's really necessary. Uh, eventually, I'll, I'll give Zagai the boot, probably. Um, yeah, but for the time being, I, I feel like this is, this is fine. Lorelei just doesn't have a sharpened weapon, or I would, I would probably take her over Zagai. Hmm. No running away this time. I'm going to save my game here, too, because it feels like it's been forever since I saved. Oh, look at that. Saved right back in the same place I saved last time. All righty. So this is finally it, huh? Yep. Are you ready, Prince? Let's begin. Use the Dawn Rune. Ah, it worked. That looks really cool.
this is it all right in the end. Sarah Slate was created to hide that. Huh. Come on, let's go check it out. What do you say? Yes, we must. All right. Well, if we must, then we must. Gate uh, ruins alone were a tremendous discovery, but I may well have topped myself with this one. I'm starting to think the best way to find Cinder Ruins is hanging around with you guys. Hey, let's go see what's inside. Uh huh. Wow, this is incredible. Are these Cinder Ruins too? Yep, no doubt about it. But it's so clean, it looks like it was built yesterday. Indeed it does. So the question is, just what exactly are these runes made of? After being underwater for so long, one would think they would be covered in weeds and algae. But look at this. It's as clean as if it were just polished yesterday. Unbelievable. The Sindar keep proving to me that they really had technology that we can barely fathom today. That's it. <coughs> Prince, why don't we make this place our headquarters? Uh-huh. Headquarters? Huh, so full on fascist. Got it. <laughs> uh, Zahak, Alinea, thank you for coming. I deeply apologize for troubling the Queen's Knights with such trivial matters. You need not worry about us. Our allegiance is with you, Gazelle. After all, you're going to be the next commander of the Queen's Knights. Shall execute any and all orders faithfully, sir. You flatter me, but I shall take you at your word for now. Now then, the increasingly impudent rebellion is spreading to the south central regi regions of Felena. Zahak, I'd like you to put an end to it. Absolutely, sir. Less than half of the soldiers who escaped from Hatred Fortress have returned to duty. Spare no pains in clamping down on deserters and drafting new troops. I'll see to that, sir. Good, now then, Elenia. Yes, sir. I'd like you to go to the West Palace. The West Palace? That's right, with her. <clears throat> okay. Okay. 
So here it is, the headquarters, finally. Um, what are we, like 30-some videos in? <laughs> ah, what a great castle. Clean, spacious, and solid as a rock. Hard to attack, easy to defend. That waterfall's making my ears ring a bit, but that's the only drawback. Drawback. Gahaha. <laughs> really? I find the waterfall rather soothing myself, but yes, it's the perfect castle at the perfect time. We really couldn't have fit any more people in Rathfleet. True, but do you think it's okay for us to be using these runes? Will the ancients be mad at us? Uh, a little late for second thoughts, isn't it? And wasn't this your crazy idea in the first place, Neil? Yeah, <laughs> kind of was. So I and Lorelai were so mad when I first suggested it, not that they're any happier about it now. Worry not, these ruins don't belong to them. This is the prince's castle now. Besides, these ruins would never have been discovered if not for him. He's got a point there. And speaking of these ruins, Prince, how about a name for our castle? We can't keep calling it The Ruins. Great idea. And since these are Sindar ruins, how about Sindar Castle? I think Mohawk Head Castle would make a... Come on, man. Get out of, get, get out of here. How about something like Castle of the May... Sigh, shimmering on the pale blue water. Wow, that's... No, I'm sorry. Sindar Castle, boring. Mohawk, are you insane in that or less one, Lucretia? Really, Lucretia, I expect your talent as a tactician, but your skill in naming leaves something to be desired. Uh, what was wrong with her name? I thought it was kind of pretty. You can't name the prince's castle something like that. And besides, that's way too many letters. <laughs> Breaking the fourth wall there. Uh, there's only one solution. We'll let the prince settle this. What do you want to name the castle? We should just ca call it Castle Leon. Um, <clears throat> let's just go with Dragon. Uh, in earlier, uh, earlier iterations of uh, of the Suikoden series, I often would either call the you know either the headquarters or the army the dragon. So it'd be like you know the dragon castle or the dragon army. So I'm just gonna go back to Dragon Castle. Now that's a decent name. As usual, the prince saves the day. Really? I liked Sindar Castle myself. Boring. <laughs> You're such a little tyrant sometimes, you know that? <laughs> what nonsense is this? You know, the regular kind. Ah, great timing. We just decided on the castle's name. We're going with Castle of the Mace. I... Yeah, sure we are. Over my dead body. Please, please, you guys, this is no time to be fooling around. Come, Prince, enough of, enough of these trivialities. Did you find something, Zweig? Indeed, a room, and I need the Prince to assist with further inspection. It's up one floor. I guess I'll go, too. Count me in as well. Okay. Going up. Let's speed this up a bit. <clears throat> All right, right here, and boom, just like that. So this is the room. What's so special about this place? Observe. The Dawn Rune. There's one here, too? What's happening? Prince, your rune. What's going on? Ooh. Hello. What was that? You saw it too? Yeah. What the hell was that? I don't know. Perhaps something left behind by the Sindar. Was the Don Rune showing us some sort of vision? It looked like the light from the Sun Rune. Could it be? This is similar to the writings in an in a certain ancient tome. Long, long ago, even before the arrival of the Sindar, a mighty dynastic nation held power in this land. Blessed by the sun rune, the dynasty was prosperous beyond compare. But one fateful day, their king went insane. His madness caused the sun rune to go berserk, destroying everything in its path. The nation was obliterated. Obliterated? You mean exactly like that vision we just saw? You understand nothing, yet you are always in the middle of everything. Ah, here she is. 
Oh, not you again. Who is this lady in black? I don't know, but she keeps barging in whenever runes are nearby. I hate to admit it, but it seems that the Dawn Rune chose you by no mere twist of fate. I have decided to remain here and observe the situation more closely. I trust you have no objections? I have all kinds of objections. Who are you and where are you from? Quit speaking in riddles, you crazy druid lady. <laughs> okay. Zeras. Zeras? What's a Zeras? My name is Zeras. I will explain nothing beyond that. Wow. But what are you... And you two over there, listen to me. I will say nothing of the Sindar, and I will say nothing of these ruins and what you witnessed here today. Hear that, Lorelei? Yeah, and I'm not too happy about it. No, I can't allow someone like you close to the prince. You've threatened to kill him before, remember? It's my sworn duty as a bodyguard to protect his highness. You'll come no closer. If I wanted it, he would already be dead, as would you, my dear. His death was not the proper course of action. Indeed, quite the option or opposite. I think it may even be possible for me to help you. Alrighty, is this? Um... Yeah. Okay. Um, so thank you. We appreciate it. Gets us a point with Saras. Prince, this lady is insane. How can you be so trusting? Silence. This boy seems to at least possess marginal intellect, which is more than can be said for some of you. Boy, you just don't have any compliments for anyone, do you? You are going to tell us what you know at some point, right? I will tell you only what is necessary and only when the time is right. All right, we've done it. We've befriended her once or finally. I was going to say once and for all, but I don't know. All right, anyways. <clears throat> well, it doesn't sound like the time's right yet. I suppose I'll study this room a little longer if you don't mind. Mind if I join you? Well, I mind. I I want them to be with me. I, They're treasure hunters, and I like that. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Oopsies. Uh, okay, here's the war room. Um, I <clears throat> don't know if I really want to go any farther. Uh, actually, yeah, I think what I'm going to do is, uh, is actually just end this one here because we're getting, uh, we're getting towards the, yeah, I'm out of time. So, all right. Anyways, uh, as always, hope the guide was helpful and thank you for watching.